Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. When we last left off, we got introduced, we saw this mysterious vision thing, I guess. Then we got introduced to this incarnation of Link and Zelda. Zelda sends Link a letter by her bird, uh, telling her to meet uh, up with her before this wing ceremony. And apparently they live in the academy and they live on this uh, big island of Skyloft, which is a big huge island above the, uh, in the sky. So they're in, they're in the sky. So anyway, let's go look around and let's go continue to look for Princess Zelda. Because that's our objective right now. So let's look around and see what we can find. Now if you, you can run. Bug. believe I'm through that way up there, so now I can't even get that rupee. That's a five rupee, too. Uh, yeah, you've got a green rupee. It's worth one rupee, so collect a lot of them. I'm not going to do the NCS green. Alright, this is the way in. Oh. Hey, Link, up here! How are you doing? Oh, who's this guy? Good morning to you, Link. Today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Yeah, what's this wing ceremony that everybody's talking about? Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remember there's something I'd like to ask you about. Look this way while pressing and holding Z, and press A to have a quick chat with me. So you hold down the Z button on the nunchuck, you press the A button, there you go. Ooh. Excellent! Always remember you can Z to target something. Once you have targeted someone with Z, you can easily talk to him or her by pressing A. Even when there isn't anything to target, press the Z is a convenient way to quickly face your view for Oh, well, it's a little silly carrying a conversation from this distance. Why don't you come join me up here? You should be able to climb up if you dash to the top of that wooden box, don't you think? Move while holding A to dash. You should be able to make that jump fairly easy. Try climbing up here. So you, so you learn some climbing mechanics. So basically, you dash toward there and you can climb pretty easily. Then jump up again. So what do you think? Using A to dash is useful, isn't it? However, don't dash around so much that you wear yourself out. Or your stamina gauge will empty and you'll be completely out of breath. It's best to take a little break when your stamina gauge gets close to empty. Got all that? On to the next point. You can jump a short distance like this by moving short toward it. I like to call it the, call it the auto jump. Oh yeah, it's the auto jump. It has a nice ring to it. So basically, just move forward and auto jump. It's pretty easy. Then let's talk to this guy. So what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice in this morning, Link? Oh? You have someone to meet. Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Perfect timing then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster Gapora. Oh, so Zelda's father's the headmaster of this uh, place. Has a pet named Mia. And well, she scampered off again. Look. Over there, do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony, I thought that maybe I should feed her. But the ceremony is about to start and I just put on a fresh set of clothes. And well, you see, will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? Go I'm on it. Yeah, if you go, uh, if, if you go I'm busy, this is a butt down bus situation. Fantastic, so you do it? I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate you taking the time to help. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb into the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. So, Link climbs really well. Alright, so we gotta go rescue the cat. So, basically you just dash up here. You see there's a little ledge. You can... oh, that was idiotic. I pushed the wrong button. I pushed the wrong button. And I kind of jumped off. Oh, this is off to a wonderful start now. Oh! Off to a wonderful start. There we go. This time, let's not fall off. I pushed the wrong button. If you push the, uh, if you swing the remote to the left, you can leap like that. And you see, uh, jump over that hole right here. These vines. It's up here. You can climb up here. Hey. hey, Link! I don't care how good a jumper you think you are. You'll never reach the roof like that high. Just press A to dash. 
There should be a wooden box up there. Grab it and move it with way and then use a platform of sorts. So you can climb on the platform by pressing A to dash or by pressing the up on the control stick for a few moments. So basically, grab onto the box with A, push it to move. Just push it against the wall. Climb up and boom. Let's go over here and get Miss Kitty. We gotta bring Miss Kitty all the way back to uh, Mr. Dude over here. Yo. You can just throw him up here. Make it a little bit easier. You may have to because I kind of kind of messed that up. There we go. And boom. Ooh, nice work. You brought her back safe and sound. Yeah, after throwing her a few times. Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Link. I suppose that should be Mia now. Please tell the headmaster that we found his cut. It should be up by the statue of the goddess. So that's our next destination. Statue of the goddess. But where's Princess Zelda? I believe Zelda's there with them, so you should hurry along. Oh, that answers my question. So let's head to the statue of the goddess. What do you have to say? Oh, morning, Link. How's life? Did you manage to get even a wink of sleep last night? Figured you might have been tossing and turning all night thinking about the big ceremony today. What am I doing? Oh, just fixing this gate here. It's been squeaking lately, and we can't have that on the day of the ceremony. Hey, you haven't already forgotten to send your prayers to the goddess this morning, have you? Just face the bird statue over there and say a short prayer to save your progress. As you know, the bird statues are all over Skyloft. It's about time you get in the habit of stopping a statue every time you run by one. <laughs> a player in time saves line, if you know what I'm saying. I'll just tell you about the same point. These are our stamina fruits. Uh, if you uh, eat one of them, you gain the stamina to, to full health. To full. But basically, just come up here. And come up here. And there we are. We might want to find Princess Zelda here. Hi, Birdie. I really, really like this incarnation of Princess Zelda, though. Like I said, a little bit more of a big romantic interest, and she's a little bit more personal with Link than most of the other Zeldas. So. I'm not going to sing that. I'm gonna let you listen to the song anyway. And uh, hey, good morning, Link. Yep. Huh. I'm glad to see my loft thing got you out of bed. Yeah, we're lazy. I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. Nah, you wouldn't forget. <laughs> well, look at this instrument, and look at this outfit. They're mighty used today in the ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Oh, okay. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. Sounds gorgeous, too. Ask Potter about it. And he, even, he says it's called a harp. Okay. Uh, well, we know what a harp is, but apparently the harps are... <laughs> and look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself and get me to use in today's ceremony. Between the harp and the outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted to be the first to see me like this. Think? Oh. So how do I look? We're going to be nice and say great. Ah, I think so too, but it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Link. We'll be nice. <laughs> Ah, oh, there you are, Zelda. Are you prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. Yep, you get to see the head fast. For the first time in the Zelda series, you get to see Zelda's father in the game. Ah, oh, Link, you're too outstanding. It's encouraging to see you up so early, giving you capacity to sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for one. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post race ritual with Zelda, so give it your best out there. Giggity? <laughs> yes, about that. 
did, did he? Father, I don't know if you can do it. Recently, he hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. Uh, look at Link's face. He's like, oh, Link is Zelda's telling the truth. And even when he's out riding his golf ring, he's just way gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. Mm -hmm. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. So you may have a point. Today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as the spawn to his bird. Victory will not come easily. Well, of course. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since he was so very little. You should know him better than you should know better than a friend about him. So apparently they're ch literal childhood friends. You see, Link and the Skyloft share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wing, the guardian bird, that the goddess has bestowed upon each of us as a symbol for dying protection, divine protection. Dying protection. When we are young, every one of us meets a loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I sure you recall. Ah, oh, but that first meeting between Link and this loft wing was extraordinary. Yeah, of course. That bird came to him with a crimson loft wing. It's a breed so rare we were sure for some time that it vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. The <laughs> Link's, uh, Link's embarrassed. Do you recall when Link and that loft wing of his first met? What a sight! The little boy just hopped on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. Judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship you shared with this bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. <laughs> Link's like, so happy. <laughs> so happy. Uh-oh. Link's sensing something wrong? Uh-oh. Ah, but who can blame you? <laughs> I'm sure you weren't the only one to be a powerful bond shared by Link and this bird. Anyone who is a part of something special is bound to catch a nasty look sooner or later. Woohoo! <laughs> she doesn't disagree, though. <laughs> the contest is nothing to laugh at. So the contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. The slip on is part of the final test for those trained to become knights. It's called. Oh, so Link trained to become a knight. Okay. So this is what it is. If Link doesn't fly fast during the, ra during the race, what if Link messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Calm down, my dear. It will be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you become a completely different person when you worry about Link. See what I mean? That's the first steps. Signs of the, ro the romantic bond. And a uh, very, very close bond between this carnation of Link and Zelda. Listen, Link, you better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. Come on, you'll thank me later. She's practically Dragon Link. Here we are, Thorn. <laughs> Jump off the edge and call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh yeah, you can't sense your bird out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel all about how to practice. I try, but you're not fooling me. I'll feel going. <laughs> she... Okay, Link, go ahead. Just press down. On the control sound. And his lost wing's not answering. Mm hmm. Hmm. This bird sure is taking a long time to get here. <laughs> Something's wrong! Yeah, see how fast these birds come? Like, Zelda's come really quick. And Link's just sitting there, like, not even there. <coughs> Hang in there, Link. I've got you! Oh god. That was close. Link almost. How far would he have fallen? Ooh. Are you two alright? Yeah. Looks like it. I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your ring, did you? This is very odd, Link. What have possibly happened to you off the wing? For a bird to annoy the call of his master is unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Link? 
there's quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Leek, when you said you couldn't sense it off wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. I need to tend to my own loft wings, so I'll catch up with you later. You better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird is gone. So, now we have a case of a missing loft wing. That bell sounds like, uh-oh, the wing ceremony sounds like getting ready to start. Link has no loft wing, no bird. Ooh. All right, how did it get me so late? If I recall correctly, this year instructor Horwell was presided over the ceremony. He gets you go and explain the situation to him to see if he was willing to delay the race a little so you can find your bird. So we gotta go find instructor Horwell, or Horwell. My oh, father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Link has instructor Horwell, he'll probably come, just come talk to you about it. <laughs> That's true. Ah, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well. I explain the situation to myself. Link, run along and tell Instructor Horwell to come see me in my quarters. All right. So now we got a now we got a new goal. Uh, find, uh, find Instructor Horwell. And uh... Link, I'm going to tend to my bird and make sure he's not. I'll catch up with you later. Go and see if anyone can help me deal off Link. So our new goal is to find Instructor Horwell. I see. Don't worry, Link. I'll be sure to explain your predicament to Instructor Horwell. Go and find him and ask me to meet my quarters. While we chat, why don't you go to some of his other students about your bird? I seem to recall a few of them were gathered near the plaza. So our new goal is to find Instructor Horwell and explain him the situation and to find our loft wing so we can do the wing <laughs> ceremony. So, yeah. So, but what could happen to Link's loft wing? What could have happened to Link's Wolf Wing? Who could have what could have happened to it? Why didn't it respond to Link? And so like that. We'll find out next time. When we come back, we'll go fault to uh instruct the Horwell and explain and tell me to get to explain the situation to him. And uh I guess we start searching around the silo off to try to find our loft wing. So have a good day, I'll see you next time. And let's play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. This is DKS3A, the crazy gamer, signing out. <laughs>